Following their dramatic split, 90 Day Fiancé viewers have been surprised by the continuous tension between Molly Hopkins and Kelly Brown. The relationship ended after Kelly allegedly choked Molly's daughter Olivia, with Cynthia Decker seemingly side with Kelly in the aftermath. Many 90 Day Fiancé fans have been curious about this story and kept wanting to find the truth behind the incident. Further answers appear to be on the way, with both Molly and Kelly supposedly due to participate in a future spin-off recorded well after the disputed incident. Many news outlets earlier claimed that some 90 Day Fiancé stars and camera teams were spotted filming at a Florida resort in January for what was suspected to be a spin-off concentrating on couples therapy. Photos from the Time Show recognized faces like Angela Dean, Jovi Dufresne, and Asuelu Pula, but a recently discovered image suggests that Kelly Brown was also present. And since this show about couples therapy, then Kelly couldn't be in it alone, Molly must be over there too. A photo obtained by Word on the Street Reality.com showed Kelly taking a selfie while hanging out with Jovi and Asuelu on a beach. That photo is no longer on the 90 Day Star's Instagram profile, but there is one of him at the beach around the time the news broke about the yet-to-be-announced spin-off. If Molly Hopkins and Kelly Brown were both there for the filming of this 90 Day Fiancé new project, it means they were filming together months after Kelly reportedly choked Olivia Hopkins. Not only that, but Molly and Olivia appear to have filed a police report about the event with Kelly at least a week after the filming. It is possible that such information will be discussed on the spin-off to make things more spicy. Nothing is certain because TLC hasn't even officially confirmed the existence of this 90 Day Fiancé spin-off. With that said, there's enough strong evidence to suggest that when the footage is released, we might receive some clear details about what happened between Molly and Kelly, as well as see them try to fix their relationship. It's incredible to think that Molly and Kelly could have reconnected for any kind of on-screen encounter after all of their reported conflict. According to the police report, Kelly and Molly's daughter Olivia had a violent disagreement about Olivia's boyfriend being at Molly's house. Kelly and Olivia had an argument in the store co-owned by Molly and her now ex-best friend Cynthia Decker around Thanksgiving last year. Kelly allegedly attacked Olivia, grabbed her by the throat, smashed her against a wall, and flung her to the ground after an argument. Molly Hopkins and Cynthia Decker's business partnership and friendship have ended as a result of that incident. Cynthia recently tweeted a photo of herself with Kelly following his split with Molly and has made some cryptic claims about the reality behind all of the drama. According to the police report, Olivia and Molly were unable to produce video of the alleged incident involving Kelly, since Cynthia was the only person who had access to the security footage. There are numerous stories connected to this situation, and while we've managed to stay on top of it with various updates, it would be wonderful to gain some additional insights from the 90 Day Fiancé spin-off show once they released it on TV. Thank you for watching. Before you leave, don't forget to like this video and to subscribe to our YouTube channel for the latest 90 Day Fiancé news and gossips. Also, follow us on social media for the latest 90 Day Fiancé memes. Links are in the description below.